Have you ever wondered what games you should keep or you should lose? Find out here at Purdue's. Present Pile Up is a game based on Elf on the Shelf. There isn't much to see here. This is a children's game of rolling and moving around a board, and every so often use dexterity to shoot things in to Santa's sleigh. The dexterity saves this game. The aspect of rolling and moving, boring, especially boring in this game. Not a whole lot to see. The dexterity of shooting the presents into the sleigh is the fun part. If that sounds appealing to you or your kids, then that is going to be the game. Not a lot of decisions to be made, but it's a little kid game. I mean, you're talking about three-year-olds can play this game. So as long as they have the dexterity to kind of press that down. With my three-year-old, I just let him kind of throw it in. The rest of us have to use a little contraption. That's how we play it, and it seems to work. Elf on the Shelf, nothing really to see here. Eh, it's your, let, let's make a buck off of an IP that people seem to like toward a game. We're going to keep it around for the little kids to play around Christmas time, but not a whole lot to see here, let's be honest. Here's present pile up the board game. Aim, toss, into win. You'll notice it's an Elf on the Shelf game. And it was only available at Target. Now, they recommend five and up, but I have played this with younger kids and have not had any problems. You do get a rule book, which we'll take a look at in a few minutes. You're going to get a board, which folds out. I'm so glad they do these multi-folds now so the box can be smaller. You have a place to put the sleigh. You can see it's very colorful with elves and reindeers and all kinds of snowmen and stuff that kids really like. You're going to get these nice big plastic presents you'll be throwing around the board. You're going to get uh, different elves, uh, different races, different genders that you'll be utilizing through the game. You're going to get a die, which will have the numbers printed on it, kind of like a Christmas font, if you will. You're going to get your good old-fashioned flipper, your catapult, which works well, actually, in this game. And your sleigh, which will have to be taken apart for each game. It's a little bit of a bummer. But as you can tell here, it goes together quite easily. It's a very nice piece of plastic. It's Santa's sleigh. So everything here is very nice. This will fit into the board right here, and it works perfectly as intended. Here is a rule book for present pile up. It's black and white, picture setup, no picture of components, but I don't think you'll have any issues. The rules as you go through, no real big problem here. And you can see the construction if you need help with that. I don't think you will. You probably need two or three minutes to read through this. You'll be up and running. I really think you could probably figure out how to play this game without this rule book, to be honest. So you're going to place the game board and you're going to place everybody on the start that's going to be playing. Simple, you're going to roll the dice, you're going to move that number of spaces, one, two, three, four, five, six, and you'll do whatever it says. Now, at the beginning of the game, everybody's going to start out with five presents and what you're trying to do is get rid of them. So what you're going to do here is you're going to toss two of them, which means you can set up your handy dandy flipper guy here, put your present in there. And you kind of want to put your foot right here, oh, and I miss, so I would get that one back, but I get to toss two, and I miss that one too. But if you miss it, if you get it in, it stays there, and you're done. Once you get all five of your presents gone, you may get more or subtract more as the game goes. There is a track right here that you can go up to. So if you have presents, you go up this track. If not, you have to go around again. If you end up on Santa's sleigh, you're the winner of the game. Who should buy this game? Fans of Elf on the Shelf. You got a little kid, Christmas time game, a little dexterity aspect. You know, you can start him. I started my kid at three. He was able to play this game just fine. Uh, we modified the throwing when he can just throw him with his hands. Everybody else is using the contraption. Yeah. Elf on the Shelf, dexterity, roll and move. I don't expect much else. We're going to keep it for the little guy to play around, but nothing to see here.